go see make sure you know Richard Themes in there for your like the, the cryptozoologist of the DEF CON world always worth seeing Richard Theme all I want to do is engage with life in a way that continues to energize and vitalize myself and contributes to others as well as to myself. So there's a reciprocal feedback loop of energy and ongoing growth and real transformation that we both experience or all experience in our lives. So I hope that will happen. But at the same time, I have no expectations that it will happen. And it really helps to have zero expectations about a situation because you're contributing from ground zero out of nothing out of nothing to nothing. Its value is the intrinsic value of the transaction itself. Have we derived value or pleasure or something from this? And if we have, shake hands and go home. Do I hope it's part of, a, part of this whole transformational engine that is reshaping society, civilization, and that I might have some influence on somebody somehow for the good? Uh, you hope so, but you don't expect to because life is short for humans uh, as land mammals go. We're not Galapagos tortoises. And it goes fast and it's fragile and it's precious and it goes into the abyss. And there's no evidence that it goes anywhere else. Now, maybe there's persistence of self and memory, which is what we mean by being alive again or more or still, but nobody knows. And so while you have the moment of vitality and possibility, you seize it because you're not going to have it forever. And when you get older, as I have, you know you're not going to have it for very long at all. So it's the richness of the experience itself that you hope will contribute something of value, but you don't have too many illusions. How many people from the 13th century, how many of those names do you know? None, maybe two or three kings. Who contributed what to who? You don't know, but you want to contribute something positive into the energy the stream of history, so that from generation to generation, if it means anything at all, you didn't live in vain. That you seize the opportunity you had while alive to do the maximum. Uh, the way Shaw put it was, uh, it's no brief candle that I've got for a few moments, it's a bright burning torch and I want it to burn as brightly as possible before I pass it on to the next generation. I want to be all used up when I die, he said. And me too. Nothing left of.